Hey, hi everyone! Today we're on our way to watch the Toronto Raptors versus Milwaukee Bucks game. Yeah, we're really excited. It's our first ever basketball match that yeah. we'll be watching. Back to an NBA match. I know. You can't ask for more than that. The match is supposed to start at 7.30. Ideally, we should be there by 6.30, but we're already late. So hopefully we get there before the game starts. Yeah. I'm a new Blazers and Raptors red. Ready for the game? So let's, let's get going. going. We're at the Union Station and walking towards Scotiabank Arena. Almost there, about to enter the game. So crowded! Yeah, we should have arrived an hour earlier. We entered through gate number 4 and after security, we took the elevator to 3rd floor. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So we are seated in section 308, uh, row 16 and our tickets were around 1. $60 for two tickets. So the game is going to have four quarters and each quarter is around 12 minutes um, and then we get like breaks in between. So we didn't know this but Adidas was giving around free sneakers to various people in the audience. Apart from that they had people coming to different sections. There was someone present in our section as well. They were hyping up the crowd and giving away free t-shirts and merchandises.
So the second quarter has started now. The camera person was in our section and they were also giving away t-shirts to fans who were like really hyped up and the loudest. So this was fun. Half time included performance by three indigenous artists. We also decided to grab something to eat during half time. <laughs> the food prices inside the arena were a bit on the higher end and it was also crowded. We ended up missing the first few minutes of the third quarter. Okay, so this is the fourth and the final quarter. So let's see who's gonna win. We're still rooting for Raptors. They are a bit behind though, so fingers crossed. Both teams played really well. In this match, our favorite was Barnes from Raptors and Lilliard from Bucks, and they were also the highest scorers. It was fun watching them on the court. So we did lose, but the match was pretty fun, and it was a great experience. Hopefully, the next time we come here, our team wins. What do you think? How was the game? It was fun! Although I would have liked it better if we would have won. I know. But it was still a fun experience. Yeah. Like, I didn't even know they used to do so many things. Giveaways, the music, dancing. I know. And it was like pretty entertaining. Wow. We'll remember for next time. Yeah. What do you think? I was, it was really fun. I've never been to a basketball game before or a Raptors game before. So yeah, I, yeah, I, feel, like, I feel like I'd want to do it again. Yeah, I know. Right? <laughs> Now we're exiting the Scotia Bank Arena. Uh, we'll probably go to Union Station and take the train back. I also wish Drake was here, but he didn't come for this game. Yeah, we've heard that Drake comes to a lot of Raptors games. I'm not a fan, but still. <laughs> so we're almost home now. I just want to say it was an amazing experience. Yeah, if you can, you should definitely go for one game at least. Yeah. The vibes, and the it's so vibes inside the stadium because when you wa you're watching it on TV, you don't yeah. really get those vibes, right? Just exactly. being there and seeing yeah. everything first time. It is so intense yeah. in there. Especially when like, you're rooting for your team and everybody around you is rooting for that team yeah, too. And everyone's fun. cheering, it's yeah. that sound, the ambience. It's really fun. That was our vlog for today. We hope you enjoyed it. Yes. Please like and subscribe to our channel for more content. Until then, bye! bye.